in our first story india remembers attack on indian parliament 20 years ago president of india and prime minister pay tributes to the fallen on the day marking the 20th anniversary of a foiled terrorist attack on indian parliament president ramnath kovin prime minister narendra modi and others paid rich tributes to those who lost their lives in the 2001 parliament attack for their service to the nation and supreme sacrifice President Kovin said that brave security personnel laid down their lives on this day to defend the Indian Parliament, the world's largest democracy, against a dastardly terrorist attack. He said the nation shall forever remain grateful to martyrs for their supreme sacrifice. Prime Minister Narendra Modi said the service of security personnel to the nation and supreme sacrifice continues to inspire every citizen. On 13 December 2001, Parliament, the supreme legislative body of India, witnessed a dastardly terror attack. that shook the conscience of the country to its core the horror is still fresh in the minds of the people of the country five terrorists of the pakistan based militant groups lashkar-e-taiba and jaish-e-mohammed infiltrated the premises in a white ambassador bearing fake stickers of the home ministry and parliament itself carrying ak-47 rifles grenade launchers pistols and grenades the terrorists breached through security cordons deployed around the parliament complex as they further drove the car inside One of the staff members, Constable Kamlesh Kumar Yadav, became suspicious of their movement. In just 72 hours, the special cell of the Delhi Police cracked the case and arrested four people: Mohammad Afzal Guru, Shaukat Hussain, Afzal Guru, and Sar Gilani. Two among them were acquitted, while Afzal Guru was hanged in Delhi's Tihar Jail in February 2013.